I'm Pete Penn, and this is my series, Migrations of Memory. This is a project that I've worked on about the Cambodian diaspora in America and the legacy of the killing fields intergenerationally. The Killing Fields was a totalitarian revolution by the Khmer Rouge that led to the deaths of nearly a third of the entire country in Cambodia. I was born in uh, Khao Yidang refugee camp, which was along the Thai-Cambodian border, and came here to the States as a baby, and we were resettled in Stockton, California. I started this in 2010 with a portrait of my grandmother. This portrait for me is the most significant or important photograph I think that I'll ever take. In my house, in my family, no one ever spoke about the past, and that's such a common story where people don't have means of even communicating with their elders. So photography, for me, it breaks down a lot of these barriers. You know, a lot of the struggles or a lot of the traumas from, from the killing fields were kind of passed on generationally to, to my generation. You know, so having grown up in, in Stockton and Long Beach in, in the 90s, there was a really bad gang problem. Children of survivors who were killing other children of survivors. So this gentleman here, this was actually in Philadelphia, and I saw this guy's hands, and, I, and it just kind of blew my mind. You know, it's killing fields, and the idea that the violence didn't necessarily stop in Cambodia. This is obviously a story that will be retold again and again and again, you know, in different communities, in every wave of refugees that we will have. I do hope that, that people look at them and acknowledge the struggle and acknowledge it's an American story.